Hey guys, it's me Sarah, and today I will be showing you guys how to make slime. So let's get started. First thing you're gonna need is you're gonna need a bowl, a spoon, color, color is optional, contact solution, um, shaving cream, and some Elmer's school glue. Make sure the glue, you don't need any, you don't need Elmer's glue, you need glue that has PBA in it. So that's all I really, really need. Um, but yeah, but let's get started. First thing you're gonna do is start by pouring your glue into your bowl. And once you're, well, once you're done pouring your glue into the bowl, add some shaving cream. Shake, shake it. And some contact solution. And mix. Mine is activating it. Here it is. So far, um, what I do last is add mine. When I make, um, now, now you're probably gonna think, well, hey, let, now let's add the food coloring or color. Add the color. No, it's not the color yet. Let it be plain white right now. Then you can add the color. But here it is. It's activating already and. Got to get the rest of it activating. It's still kind of sticky, but. Oopsie. Don't get it. Don't use too much of your activator because if you do, it will just be a hard and it won't be, it will be too solid or firm. I should say it will be too solid it would be too solid if you have studied matter in school okay I think it is ready like I'm not sure I'm not sure if it's ready or not I think it is so guys I know this is ready here it is it's ready for me to knead in my hands so I'm just gonna go ahead and need this. Oh no, it, I don't think it was ready. Yet. But I'm just gonna go ahead and put it back in the container and add. Don't. Okay, so I just need it in my hands and it was horrible. Um, next time I'm gonna get it all ready still. Get it ready still. There. Okay, so now I'm gonna add some contact. I buried my spoon in here. Contact solution. And now we're gonna add some shame. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna need it in the bowl. And guys, can I tell you some thing? Sorry guys, my camera flipped. I don't know. But can I tell you something guys? Um when you make slime, the best way to do it is having measure cups or something like having something to measure it in. Because if you're a first time maker, like when I first made it, um, it was horrible because it was too much activator. I added too much of the activator to it. And then it just turned in, it wasn't stretchy at all. It was more putty. I made putty slime. So guys, 
so you discover everything when you're first trying when you're first trying to make slime it doesn't turn out perfect because you have to make the i think this is more jiggly slime this just kind of jiggly um it's perfect color i'm just gonna put it back in the bowl and just get all the glue that we didn't get because that's what you do so that way you can get the glue and have more or just kind of like scoop it out Sorry guys, my camera keeps going down. I'm just gonna put you guys right here. Here's the corner. But so far it's perfect. Like I think it's more like jiggly slime. Have you comment down below? I wanna comment down below what's your favorite kind of slime? I want to know. Is it jewelry slime, fluffy slime, or for me, mine would be fluffy slime, or slime, or regular slime, or flown. But yeah, once you think you are done, you can just leave it solid, a solid color, like just leave it white. But I'm deciding not to because I want to have color ones i had a white one and i decided to add a little food coloring to it so this one i'm adding pink food coloring i'm adding pink food coloring pink see right there you add one to three ratio oh, not the one three ratios one to four drops one to eight drops because you don't want it to stain your hands but i'm only adding four I'm adding four because I don't want it to be, like, make sure it won't stain my hands. Now, if you add eight, if you add nine, it's fine. It will stain your hands, but only for a little while. And then it will come off your hands. See, after, actually, when you're kneading it, it will stain your hands. Because while you're kneading it, it will come out. See, it stained my hands right there. But... It's doing good so far. I like the color of it, but it just looks so cool. It's so cool. Um, my next slime that I will make, it will be regular slime, but comment down below. I'm gonna make full on or regular slime. Guys, here's the pink color. I'm gonna add more contact, um, not more contact, more full coloring. So let me just add some more. One, two, three, four. Okay, I added four drops just to give it like more four, like that same thing, bless that. By the way, guys, you can get food coloring at Walmart because that's where I found mine. And I don't know where else you can get it, but I got mine. I got my food coloring at Walmart. And yeah. This is getting better. Look, it's getting color. I need two more drops. Well, actually, I think this is perfect. Like, this is a perfect color. Okay. Okay. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe. Click post notifications on. Make sure to like it up. And make sure to follow me on Musical.ly. And, um... Yeah, that's it. Okay, I love you guys so. I love you guys so much. Bye.